Well, the Department of Natural Resources says the season, the sturgeon season, is up and running, but it's actually running much slower than usual. Right, as we mentioned earlier, many of the people who usually fish opted to stay off the ice this year due to poor ice conditions on portions of Lake Winnebago. Fox 11's Kelly Schlicht was along the shores of Lake Winnebago today, and she brings us a closer look at how some of the fishermen fared for the day. The decoys were dropped, but on the opening day of sturgeon season, it seemed as if the fish didn't get the memo to swim by for a bite. We've probably at least done at least 20, so... DNR fisheries expert Jake Thompson says only 17 sturgeon were registered on Lake Winnebago by noon on Saturday. On a typical year, each registration station on the lake would see about two dozen by that time. The opening day total capped out at only 39 on the entire lake. It's a lot cloudier this year than it has been in the past. So out here they're getting like eight, eight feet, eight to ten feet clarity. There's also the question of safety on the ice that hasn't had many deep freezes to solidify it. Fishermen we spoke to say they're changing their mode of transportation to get out to their shanties this year because of the thinner ice. Ice fishing, I've been taking a four-wheeler. I haven't been driving on Winnebago. But many are staying away altogether. We're playing our safe. And it's never completely safe. It, it's all at your own risk. I just hope they know where they're going and what they're, what's underneath them when they're driving. Um, I wouldn't take a vehicle out there, but that's just personal preference. Still many ventured out. The DNR says there were just shy of 2,200 shacks on Lake Winnebago this year. That's compared to 4,300 shacks last year. The majority were on the east side of the lake and the southern tip, where the ice is thickest. I go on the west side, but um, because of the ice conditions, we did come over to the east side. We got a good salad. 16, 18 inches right here, so we're, we're pretty safe. And while the day yielded a disappointing harvest, fishermen say the camaraderie was the best thing they caught on the ice. On Lake Winnebago, Kelly Schlicht, Fox 11 News. With the pace of the harvest, the DNR says it does expect the season to go for the entire 16-day period on Lake Winnebago this year. On the Upper River Lakes, it is a different story. 66 female sturgeon were taken there today, and if 17 are taken tomorrow, the season there will come to an end.